guys so before we get in with today's video i'm starting off my morning real quick so uh, this is right here um this is basically what i eat um i, I got some strawberries got some protein powder real quick so i'm about to make me a little like protein smoothie and stuff so uh, yeah let's get into it Yo, what's up guys, welcome back to another episode guys. Today, we are gonna be building my little uh, baby ball python, a new enclosure guys. She needs an upgrade, she's been in this little box for about a few days. So, basically what we're gonna do is go put her in one of the two by two by four grow tents. So, uh, yeah, it's gonna be really cool. Um, the vertical, it's like a vertical grow tent at the moment. Um, I can always switch it to the side once she once she gets a little bit bigger, but uh, yeah, um, guys, I just fed the red tail catfish, so he is looking around for some food. Look at him! I just fed him a little bit of uh, worms and salmon. So uh, look at that guy; he is looking amazing. I cannot wait until he gets like four feet. That's just gonna be so cool. We have a huge pool pond, so uh, it's just a constant cleaning up this enclosure and stuff. Who's little guy? Cause he is growing like crazy. All right, you guys, here we are. We got Athena, my baby ball pipe. Well, she's trying to like curl up. So that's where they get their names from. They're always trying to protect their heads and stuff. So that's why they basically ball up into a little ball when they're littler, um, when they're frightened. So that's what she's trying to do here. As you guys can see, her little head is just underneath there. But yeah, guys, we'll be getting her, her own new enclosure today. I feel like she deserves it. Um, you know, she's getting bigger. Uh, once I first got her, she was tiny, like really, really tiny. So uh, I feel like she deserves her new enclosure. Without further ado, let's go. Let's go create the whole new enclosure for. Her. Here she is. <laughs> and guys, whenever I'm holding Athena, she never wants to be held. Um, so when I put my hand down like this, she tries to jump up all. Look, look, and she does. She does that every single time. She tries to jump off my hand and land straight on the floor. So, uh, yeah, now let's build her enclosure. All right, you guys, um, something I was trying to figure out. I'm not sure if I want to put her in this one. I feel like she might be able to get out just from these little holes like right here. So I'm not thinking about putting her here, but I just love how I can just look right through it. You know what I'm saying? So, I guess we're not gonna put her in here, but for the time being, we're gonna put her in this grow tent and we're gonna fix it up really nicely for it. All right, y'all, just like that, we are finally finished the little enclosure for the baby ball python. Uh, it's pretty hard to see in here, so I'm gonna get a light real quick. But we got one little hide right here. Um, this is basically just a little Tupperware hide that I had with Athena, my ball python, since she was a baby. And then this is a larger hide. She can get all the way up underneath there and it doesn't have a heating pad in there. So uh, this is a heated hide and a not heated hide. Um, I'm gonna get a water dish of some sort, sit it up there for her. And uh, yeah, I mean, that's basically it. She can climb up there, um, get some height. Um, I'm making sure that soon I can have another branch come up here. So just so she can bask, do whatever she wants. And I definitely gotta get some UVB in here. They don't need it, but I just think that for a ball python, they should definitely have it. Uh, there y'all go. So we got some better lighting in here. So now I think it's time to get the Athena, my baby ball python. Let's sit her in her new home. All right, you guys. Right here we got Athena, my ball python. So without further ado, let's grab her. 
So let's just sit it right here on the floor and do a little crawl around. Let's see. Here you go, girl. This is your new, your brand new enclosure. You see her like right here. But yeah, she's definitely gonna go hot. But guys, she looks so skinny, but she is a fat ball python. Like she literally eats like every meat. You know, a huge meal every week. So this girl is gonna be growing fast in no time. And uh, yeah, here she is, right underneath there. So we're gonna leave her alone. And uh, we'll probably come check on her later on today. All right, y'all, so before we end today's video, I wanna give y'all a little update on all the animals. There's a red-tailed catfish right there. He is doing amazing. I'm gonna actually just fed him a couple meals. He has some worms and some salmon. So his stomach is full to the capacity right now. The baby Oscar is back there chilling as well. So these guys are doing just fine and guys let me know in the comments down below what kind of monster fish i should get next for this aquarium because this guy is growing at a very really really fast rate and i can't wait until we can put him in the pool pond so uh yeah let's move on to the next animal all right you guys we got ace right here what's up ace this is my bird guys um he was actually just flying around this whole entire enclosure. whoa yeah see what i mean he likes to fly around the whole entire garage and he's flying back <laughs> yeah he's just flying look Look at him at. As y'all can see, right back on top of the enclosure. So yeah, guys, now let's go move on to my baby snap turtles because I gotta feed them their first meal today and uh, then we'll end the video. All right, you guys, you already know the deal. Um, right here, I got some worms. Look, they're already excited. Look at that one right there. He's ready. Boom, he got one. And uh, let's see, here we go. This is baby, this is Browser Jr. right here. Here we go, come here, come here. Boom, there you go. Oh, he, he kind of has partial. Okay, there you go. He had the tongues and, <laughs> and the little piece of mealworm in his mouth. And that back there is Toka. Um, one of you guys named Toka down in the comments below. Yeah, guys, that's the Baby Snapping Turtles. We're gonna let them finish their meals. And uh, that's basically it. All right, you guys, before we enter this video, guys, I got a little Bible verse right here for y'all on my phone. So today we are reading James chapter one through 19. Um, understand, understand this, my Christian friends. We must all be careful to listen. We should not be too quickly to speak. We should not get angry quickly. So, guys, I hope y'all absolutely enjoyed today's episode, guys. And uh, I'm gonna basically catch y'all on the next episode, which is tomorrow's video. If y'all do not know, um, yeah, guys, we'll catch y'all. Peace out.